Leo. <laughs> I did that because I'm jealous as fuck. Leos. Leos. As I hop into this reading, please keep in mind that the roles in this reading can be reversed. I could be saying you, it could be them, I could be saying she, it could be a he. Flip-flop the roles according to your situation. You be your own leader of discernment when it comes to this reading. You pick and choose what fits and what does not fit according to your situation. I could be saying your mama, it could be your daddy, your auntie, your uncle, your lawyer, your daddy, your anybody, okay? You be your own leader of discernment. Now again, Leos. <laughs> Shoe don't fit, it just don't fucking fit. It ain't your story, okay? Leave it. Leo, you could be jealous as fuck. Yes, you. Or it could be somebody else jealous as fuck. Or y'all could be dealing with another Leo. Somebody is jealous as fuck. Ooh, and it's all because... Look what it's because. Because you healing. So these people are mad because you healing. They thought she was going to be down forever. They thought your face was going to be... Messed up, but it's still messed up a little bit, right? <laughs> no, I'm just playing. They thought she was going to be down forever. They thought whatever they did to you, it was just going to break you. It was going to break you. But you're healing. Whatever it is. They could have probably had to kill you, ruin your self-esteem. They could have hurt you bad. Like, you know, you healing now. You good. And they like, how the fuck is this hoe? They looking at you like you're like walk the walking dead. Like what the fuck? Didn't we already all those attempts? How the fuck is she he still going? Tell them how you feel. Some of y'all this person has been manipulating you, been acting a certain way, been purposely making you jealous because they know you care. So childish. No communication. Somebody's been purposely Acting in a certain way to get a reaction out of you as well. Okay. Plan. It will be a project or a new baby because somebody is really single. I feel like they want to see, do you really care about them? Somebody's been being a playboy or a playgirl. They feel like you are a play, playboy or playgirl. So, like, they want this re Somebody's been trying to get a reaction out of you or something. Yeah, manifesting. They manifesting this. The test. They're testing you. I've been going through some things and can't nobody understand me. Stay away. I, but it's in reverse. I feel like this person can't stay away from you much longer. They've been trying to, but they can't do it no more. It's fucking driving them insane. Okay? Yeah, because they want to be with you forever. Pay attention. What sign just flew out? Leo. Oh, I'm doing <laughs> Leo. Leo, pay attention. Oh my this person won't forever with you. I'm about to cry. Y'all, and they could be jealous. Some of y'all they're jealous as fuck of you not speaking to them and giving other people attention and not them. Oh, yeah, they feel like you breadcrumbing them. Like, you not... Somebody feels like you not giving them your all. They want to see the real you. They said, Leo, lying. I know you that big old loving person. You rule the heart. They want to feel it too. Somebody don't want to feel... They don't, they tired of seeing you being that playboy, playgirl energy. Or this could be you feeling it. They want to see the real you. But I'm hearing you want to see the real them, too. It has to be like an icebreaker, a deal breaker. I don't know. Let it go. Oh, but somebody's like, why don't we just let this go? What y'all going to do, though? What y'all going to do? Why don't you be you and I'm going to be me? Somebody's ready to let it go, though, because somebody feels like somebody is a playboy or playgirl. What's the background surrounding energy for my Leos for May 2022? Six of swords in reverse. So, somebody is putting up a fight. 
somebody feels like they're not getting guided to move the common waters with this person that they're feeling guided to move elsewhere what is the six of swords in reverse for my leos queen of pentacles in reverse so it's like somebody is focused too much on the money yeah what you don't see is you're resisting some type of transformation or ending the lovers in reverse, the high priestess, queen of cups, queen of swords, eight of wands, nine of cups, six of swords, the empress, the devil. So somebody is like, I have to let this go. You have to do you and I have to do me. Because they feel like it's a toxic bond. They feel like somebody is only in it for the money and they have other people and they're players. Clarify the Six of Swords in reverse for my Leos. We got the Hermit, Ace of Pentacles, and Eight of Swords in reverse. So somebody is like, I have to isolate myself from the world right now. You know, I got to be by myself. I got to focus on my money. There's a brand new opportunity. There could even be a baby. That's that project or a new baby. There could be a business coming some money that's coming and somebody's like i just have to be by myself when this come to free myself i'm hearing leos y'all have a lot of um i'm talking to some leos that have been through a lot with people and you possibly feel like people just gravitate towards you for your money right that's it when you you're doing good money's good you have a new job you know you look shiny like you got something going so right now you feel like I got to just be by myself because I feel like y'all only come around when I got money. Y'all meaning like family, friends, or a lover, right? And right now, I got to be selfish with my time and my resources, and I just got to focus on myself. Like you possibly was doing with you, right? So I got to isolate myself. I got to get me together, and I just got to be, I got to be a little selfish for me to get by this mental entrapment. Because I see every time I, you know, I see what it is. It's just for, it's, somebody, Leo, yes, they only gravitate towards you for your money. Yeah, yeah, ho, let's be honest. To be honest, come on. Rest in peace, young dog. Mm -hmm. All right, my fellow Leo, my Leo, that's another Leo. Come on now, somebody's like, let's be honest. To be honest, I don't care about your opinion, where the check. gonna tell you some of y'all could be dealing with a Virgo for some of you guys somebody knows you're put okay for some of you guys you're putting up a fight with somebody you're not letting something go and they know why they know what they did and they know because of some money they they're gonna hand it over they're gonna hand it over Told you I was a dog baby when we first met. Show me week one. Eight of swords. So somebody is for sure in the mental entrapment. They really don't know what to do week one. Somebody could be feeling a little paranoid, a little possessed, all in their head. The high priestess in reverse. Queen of wands in reverse. Nine of swords in reverse. So there's some secrets that is coming out about a side piece, a mistress. Somebody is for sure, for sure, jealous as fuck of somebody. Okay. Oh, we got a Leo in here. There's a Leo in here. Yeah, week one, there's some secrets coming out. Somebody is jealous as fuck of somebody. There's somebody being promiscuous, being a little hoe, okay? Some secrets is coming out about some black magic. Whatever was hidden is coming out, okay? Something is getting exposed that somebody could be a little... They're not nurturing. They're not caring. They're emotionally manipulative. Somebody could be depressed as well. This is strong depression. Somebody could also be depressed. And somebody needs to cut that shit the fuck out. Somebody also talks crazy. <laughs> somebody could be a little snappy. Okay. There's a situation that is just draining. Somebody could be finding out that they are or they were the side piece in a situation with somebody. And because of that, somebody could be heavily depressed and feeling down and out and defeated because they possibly gave they all to somebody that 
you was the side piece. Yeah, and it's all right. You the hurt, wounded soldier, but you're going to be moving forward from this exhausting, draining bullshit. False-ass relationship that somebody had you in. What is this Eight of Swords for week one? Justice in reverse. Some of y'all could be dealing with a Libra. There's some injustice ass shit going on in the family dynamic as well, too. Some secrets is coming out. Oh, there's a high priestess. There's somebody doing black magic on somebody. Yeah, the secrets is coming out. This person don't got their screws too um too tight, tightly on. Somebody's doing black magic on somebody. They're trying to like they're trying to fuck with somebody in their sleep realm. Yeah, there's a black magic bitch. There you do black magic. With the high priestess in reverse and queen of wands in reverse. This bitch does black magic. Okay? With bad and very bad intentions with the magic that they do. You get what I'm saying? Purposely. People that ain't did shit to nobody, nothing. They just do it just because. Clarify this Eight of Wands. I'm sorry, Eight of Swords. What is this Eight of Swords? <clears throat> Someone could even be feeling paranoid or possessed. Eight of Cups. See, somebody's walking away, though. Somebody's walking away. Because they're going to be, somebody's going to be finding out what was really going on behind the scenes with somebody that was doing black magic on them or somebody that had a side piece or was, or they're finding out that they were the side piece. Yeah. There's three people in this mix. There's somebody at a distance as well, too. Somebody's going to be quickly moving on at a distance from these people or this person. Something is going to come out. Somebody's acting like they're in a mental entrapment. They're like, they don't see what's going on, but you see what's going on. This bitch is doing black magic on you. For sure. And they're hiding and acting like they're not. Show me week two. Two of Cups. See, there's a relationship in here. You guys. There's for sure a relationship in here. Week two, you might just get be back in union with this person for some of you guys you could be noticing you were off balance with this person that you love and want to be with because there is a third party in here or there is somebody that is jealous as fuck of you doing black magic on you and your relationship okay i didn't did three leo readings and they ain't been able to get out there, I still have them, and they all been talking about this black magic that's been going on. Somebody's causing harm, danger on somebody, plotting on somebody, somebody getting shot. Y'all, what is this, Two of Cups? Leo, I mean, and somebody posted that, too. Like, do you do Leo readings anymore? I'm like, I wanted to say yes, and I'm glad y'all noticed this, but the Leo energy's been hectic. Some of these... What is this, Two of Cups? I can put this one out, though. This is This is like, you know... Two of Cups. Y'all, y'all got somebody that's so jealous of you. Because they know that there's a real relationship that is coming to you. Something that is divinely guided. Something that you don't got to do no love spell for this. You get what I'm saying? It's going to feel like it's a love spell. But you're going to be high off of that real love. Because this is real. This is real. I feel like y'all could have possibly been running away from each other, but you can't deny this, right? The more and more y'all try to be separated from one another, the more and more you can't stop thinking about this person. Or this person can't stop thinking about you. This other third party knows this, though. That's why they're doing this black magic. That's why they're trying to stop you guys from coming together. Because they've been possibly dealing with this person for so long. But not really wanting nothing out of it and been okay with it. And now it's somebody that's really being serious with this person. Like, yeah, you know I like you. Yeah, you know I want to be with you. But I'm not about to go at it at these terms. So what you going to do? And this person is trying to make it do what it do. But this other person ain't letting it happen. So, clarify this two of cups. I feel like week two you going to get back and connect with this person. But there's still somebody trying to stop it. What is this two of cups for week two? This relationship is judgment. Yeah. Somebody feel somebody knows that they've been put somebody's been putting somebody off to the side that they truly want to be with and really want to make it work. Look at this. King of Pentacles and Ace of Swords. You know this person is stable. You know this person is grounded. You know that. And that's the truth.
some of you guys feel like you weren't so grounded and you weren't so stable at the time. So some of y'all felt like since I'm not so got myself together, some, and especially financially for some of y'all, I want to get myself together so I can be upright for you since I know you upright. You get what I'm saying? It's like somebody was trying to get themselves together for this person, but I feel like this person is done. Trying to wait. They might even come through and try to offer you some type of help. Look at this. The chariot and the lovers. Seven of wands. This person is ready to come protect you. Clarify this two of cups. The star. What if everything I just said? Y'all may not be speaking. Y'all may not be communicating. But the star on top of this two of cups in judgment. We too. Y'all gonna get this thing back rolling. Judgment is being called down. The star is here. That's healing. That's restoration. Somebody's about to restore this. Somebody's about to restore this relationship. The universe is doing it. Because the universe said, you know you can't be without this person. You know you can't. You've been trying to be without this person, but it ain't been working. It ain't working. Power. You got the power. They got the power. Okay. You got that power, love, on me. You got that power. Show me week three. Show me week three. The devil in reverse and ten of swords. So week three, whoever it was that was fighting this is devastated. Because they see that whatever it was toxic that they kept trying to throw your way, those those chains is being broke. That spell work is being broke. It's being broke week three. It's broke. Them constraints is being broke because you got the power to break this shit. You got the power. You broke this shit. And somebody is devastated. Could be a Capricorn in here. Devastated. Somebody wanted to have a bond, a bound and some type of control over you and constraint to you. And what you can do with your life and your love life, it ain't working. The universe is breaking that shit. Week three, it's broke. It's done. You're able to plan and move forward. It's done. What's week three? Clarify the ten of swords, the devil. The so Oh, wait a minute. Hold on, y'all. The sun and justice, y'all could be dealing with a Libra. It's going to get exposed and you're going to get the justice that is deserved to you. Okay? Something's going to get exposed. The tower in reverse and eight of, oops. Clarify ten of swords and the devil in reverse. Somebody is devastated because you're getting the justice due to you, the karma that is due to you, the good karma that is due to you. Clarify ten of swords and the devil. Justice. You there. But then we got the, the world in reverse, ten of swords and queen of swords, knight of cups. See, this is karma coming through. This is justice being served. You're getting something that is deserved to you. But there's some unfinished business with somebody in the background that is devastated. Somebody else in the background is putting up a fight. They don't want to see you go. They feel like they invested a lot of money and time into you or something. Y'all, who is this other person? Somebody is upset because you're going to be moving on. What is this? Show me week four. 10% in reverse in the higher fence. Some of y'all could be dealing with the Sagittarius. But somebody is like, you're not healing the situation. because you're Like, you're not even... There could be like a rush marriage. Somebody could be getting married. Y'all could be dealing with the Sagittarius and the, and the Taurus in here. Somebody does not want to heal a situation. And, and be, it's like they don't want to heal a situation. They're going to be move, moving up to a higher level of commitment with somebody else. Somebody could be getting married week four. Clarify the higher fan and temperance in reverse. Somebody could also be getting admitted somewhere for overindulging or drinking. Clarify the higher fan 
Six of Pentacles and King of Wands. Nah. The lovers and So something is being fair and balanced. This man is coming through and, and being loyal to you. Yes, they are. Somebody is being loyal to you. I feel like somebody is, is giving you their loyalty and their love. Somebody is finding out that somebody was given to two other people as well, too, though. Seven of Pentacles in reverse. Somebody feels like this was a waste of time and bad investment. Somebody could, might actually have to be giving up child support or alimony or something. We got Page of Swords and Eight of Wands. Somebody is stalking the fuck out of somebody. Oh, my God. What's the outcome of this? Y'all, somebody is pissed off. What's the outcome? Three of Swords in reverse. You're going to be able to heal yourself from this third party situation. Or this heartache and this pain. So there's for sure with a third party. But somebody is getting, not, somebody's getting kicked out of the picture. Whoever it was that was lying, betraying, doing spell work, they're just getting, they're, like, the universe is, like, booing them out the picture. Okay, somehow, some way, they're getting booted the fuck out the picture. Clarify this three of swords in reverse. Three of wands in reverse and nine of pentacles in reverse. What is this? So this is somebody still bringing blockages and disturbances your way. They don't want you to be free. Nine of pentacles in reverse. They don't want you to be free. They don't want you to move forward. Then we got two of cups and night. So somebody, so they're going to try to rush and marry you to keep you bound and control. I don't like this, y'all. Somebody's about to try to keep, yeah, somebody's about to try to rush and marry you. Damn, y'all. What the fuck is this? For the money. What is there? Three of swords in reverse. Three of, yeah, three of cups sideways, y'all. Ten of wands. Somebody about to try to rush and marry you. What's going on? The streets. I feel like the streets know about this. Isolation. You may be isolated from this person right now. Somebody lying. Somebody thought the grass would grow on the other side, possibly with a Libra, and they possibly coming back around now. Ashamed and regrets, wash your food and drinks around them. Close friends, it's all for the money. Set up and robbery. So for a lot of you guys, this person listened to a lot of their close friends when it came to you. There was a lot of rumors and gossip and a lot of toxic shit going on, a lot of spell work, black magic. When it come to y'all, a close friend said that this person, you thought that, basically you only wanted them for their money. You only wanted them for the money. You were trying to set them up. You were trying to rob them. You was a gold digger. But in actuality, you are a healer. You are nurturing and you are caring. You possibly didn't give them the, your all of you because you was Queen of Pentacles in reverse. You was going through some things, okay? You was going through some things. You were trying to balance out your finances. You were trying to work on yourself. Now they see you are their soulmate. They apology. I'm sorry. Now they want to apologize, okay? Now they want to say I'm sorry. They might even want to give you a purchase or purchase something with you, go half on you. They see that you really are transforming yourself, trying to balance yourself out. They don't want to let you be free. Nine of Pentacles in reverse, okay? They looked at you as a gold digger and selfish and all of this in the beginning, but now they see you as just working on yourself. And now they can't let you be financially free because you're really working on something and something big you get what i'm saying and right now they can't let you just be free because if they let you be free right now then somebody else is going to take all this greatness and goodness okay i look i do care but i don't feel i don't know y'all it might just really be for the finances for your stability what's going on what's going on relapsing every time i come you see, somebody could have addictions as well, too. What is going on? Glamour spell. Ending. Oh, there's an ending to the glamour spell. 
Who am I talking to? Leo's back in the beginning. Remember I said they tried to, mm, mm, mm. Okay. There was a glamour spell. They said you weren't who you really said you were. They tried to make you look ugly. They possibly did things, to put things in your makeup, your hair products, um, face products. They lace your weed, your blunts, your alcohol. They did a whole lot of crazy things. Actual spell work on you to make you look ugly. Bring down your image. You're a whore. You're a gold digger. You like to set people up. You like to rob people. Blase, blase. It's an end into that. It's done. Remember I said week three, the spell work is over. It's done. The universe said you can no longer. No more of that. No more of that. It's no more spell work. It's done. What is this? There's about to be an unexpected change. Wow. STD? Wiretapped? Going broke. Case study. Some of y'all, this person has wiretapped you. Somebody is wiretapped. Somebody has an STD. Somebody is going broke. And they're only coming back around because of those, those things. What? Higher commitment? I don't like this. What is this? Justice. So I'm already hearing off top, there was gang stalking going on. These people have, they, they wiretapped you. Somebody said you had an STD. So somebody wiretapped you to watch you. To get information on you, somebody's lying about their sexuality. I possibly said you're lying about their sex. You're lying about your sexuality. It's time for you to detox your mind, body, home, and soul. The ambition and time is now. I don't like this. Like whoever this is, they're really sick. Okay, they're really a stalker. I'm not even about to go there. Like y'all have people that've been. Ca you were the case study. So there was like a group of people that wiretapped you. Like just, what? How do these people sleep at night? Deception. You feel me? How do they sleep at night knowing that these bitches is fucking psych? What? Bitch, y'all belong in the feds, okay? With all these false accusations. Remember Glamour anyway? Talking about somebody's a side piece or likes being a side piece or something. They had a lot of wishful thinking when it came to you, okay? And there's some clarity on that. What the fuck going on? Yeah, clarity. Leo, these people were jealous as fuck of you. Yeah. Hello, they could probably said that you were thieving and stealing. Yeah, they were the ones stealing and thieving. The fuck are you got me wiretapped for? Right? To set you up and to rob you, Leos. To set you up and to rob you. The whole time they saying you like to set people up and you like to rob people, but they then fucking got you wiretapped to set you up and to motherfucking rob you. Make that shit make sense. I love y'all so... Let me keep going. Because this just made me so irritated. <laughs> like, these people... But the spell work is done and it's coming to light, so karma's about to be coming back around full fledged on that ass. Okay? Yeah. They're cheating, they're creeping at night. Hiding their true feelings. I'm trying to tell you, this is mental issues. Because you're doing it real big and without them. This is their karma. They're fucking juggling. Some of y'all, it's a doctor involved in here. Somebody is faking, acting like they are a doctor. There's a doctor involved in here that could possibly be getting arrested or going in jail for something that was be that was done. Okay, some of y'all could be dealing with a doctor. Or, yeah, a doctor could have withheld some information or told some lies about somebody having an STD. Or was involved with trying to hide an STD. I don't know. Could be a Virgo. Um, the star. You will be healing, though. Pay attention to their undertone and dealing with children. Huh? No communication and work. 
This is also like somebody independent. There was a lot of rumors and gossip too about somebody and your in their children and what they do with their children. Yeah, that's all. Wow. Like people you work with, like how you raise your kids, how you handle them. Yeah, they're contemplating it. What is this? Stagnant. Give it. Return to sender. Yep. And use your intuition. They was being selfish. But this all coming to light. I feel like everybody's seeing what the fuck is going on. Drugs and alcohol. Yep, I said it. Reach out. Somebody also wants to let you know that they they were dealing with drugs and alcohol. Yeah, that's why they acted the way they acted. I don't know. What is this? Manifesting. Do you. Somebody did something to somebody drugs and alcohol as well, too. Somebody slipped somebody something. Okay. Somebody also has a drug and alcohol problem. Authority, past lover, I do care. Heavy protection coming out the closet. Some of y'all, this past lover is actually, y'all know they on the DL. And that's why you have to reject them because you possibly know that. And they're only coming back around talking about I do care because they could probably be in some trouble with the authorities, okay? And they're going broke. I love y'all. I just bought my mama a new crib. Yeah, do what I did. Hiding evidence. Hacking your shit. They're hiding evidence that they hacked your stuff. It's time for you to love on yourself. This ex is only coming back around because they're getting exposed that they didn't hack your stuff and they're stalking you. And they're nasty. Don't trust it. Don't trust it. I love y'all so much. Take care.